Okay, this is the Athenian lot. Um, you come up the elevator to the fourth floor, and then you gotta walk up those stairs to the fifth floor, uh, where it has a its own apartment on top here. So this is an older area, um, and uh, they remodeled, I guess, and, or built an apartment here on top. And it's quite nice. It's got extremely high reviews on Airbnb. Uh, but when you walk in the door here and you turn to the right, this is the kitchen area. Um, it has a refrigerator, freezer. Uh, they've done a really good job of providing things. I mean, it's got a coffee maker or hot water maker. It's got a, uh, a, um, a microwave oven. It even has a washer and I guess washer dryer combo. I don't know. We haven't used it. It's got a, it's got a stop stove here on top and dishes. And there's other things in here too. Dishes in there. Uh, silverware so they've really stocked it we did a really fine job for people that want to stay here um, you know for a week or two or whatever we're here for uh, four nights and uh, oh it's got a back deck right here it's on the back deck and then that it opens up from the back uh, of the master bedroom coming back out there's from the kitchen is a little nook area they have Wi-Fi right there um, the Wi-Fi is a bit slow, so I wasn't able to send pictures to a friend of mine on my cell phone through the Wi-Fi because it kept failing, but uh, it seems to work well with my laptop. Um, I just used cell service to send the pictures and they were sent immediately. Um, so the Wi-Fi could be better. I think it looks like he has DSL type service here. So anyways, um, uh, it, there is a bathroom here in the center and... This is the bathroom. The counter for the bathroom is a little, pretty much non-existent. So we've been using the uh, sink in the kitchen to do brush our teeth. But this is what the bathroom looks like. And it's updated. And there's the shower. Uh, there's the toilet. And as you can see there, you're not supposed to flush toilet paper down the toilet. You need to put it in the, right there instead which is really weird. We've never had to do that anywhere else. So anyways, just keep that in mind. When you're in Greece, it's not a thing for here. It's, it's a Greek thing. Uh, hi, Jules. Hi. We just got back from going to the corner store. Oh, that's right. Uh, it's like a, a block away. There's just a little uh, smaller store, which has produce and things like that. But, uh, um, it's, con it's close, it's convenient. We were able to pick up some water and, and stuff. And Jules is just relaxing in a nice, cool yes. room. Oh, it does have AC. So right there is one of them. And there's another one out there. So when we walked in, it was nice and chilly in here. Uh, there is a uh, closet here for, to put your stuff and some drawers, a dresser place to put your bags there's more storage up on top here if you want um, you can hang stuff uh, this is one of the two entrances or exits to the deck and there's the hot tub which Jules and I are going to enjoy tonight uh, we didn't last night yet but I just filled it up with some water uh, and I'll just let it heat up in the 88 degree weather but here this is why people rent this place first off it's in the heart of where everything is but there's the acropolis right there um and the parthenon right there so as you can see it's uh it's close it's walking distance it's like a quarter mile uh or about five blocks maybe um for us to be, we are we are we did pay for a tour so tomorrow morning we're doing a morning tour. Uh, we're meeting at the Acropolis and we'll go to the Parthenon and we'll see different sites there. And then we'll end up uh, at the museum, which is only about three blocks down the street that, that way. So as you can see, it is kind of an older part of Athens. Well, obviously it's right where the 
Parthenon is, so it's, it is older, but, uh, but the place that we're renting here has actually been updated. It's, they have uh, internet, they have Wi-Fi, they have a AI tool that you can ask it questions and it will tell you answers. So it's, and it works pretty well, actually. It works fairly well. Here's the rest of the deck and a uh, place to sit and have my morning coffee. Um, and here's the other entrance that goes into where the, um, where the dining area is. But there's no handles on the outside. So anyways, there it is. Hey, baby. <laughs> so I'm going to post this on YouTube for people that want to find out more about this place. But it's definitely, uh, I would rent this place again. It is really nice. Um, there's places to walk um, that are all close with lots of restaurants. There's, like I said, a corner street. A kind of a small grocery store that's just a block away. Um, there is last night we went across the street and had Thai food, um, which was really good. Um, after we've been on a boat for two weeks and uh, we've had plenty of Greek food, so it was nice to actually have something different. Okay, well, that's it. There it is the Athenian, Athenian loft in Athens. You probably won't be disappointed and if you've read the reviews you can see they're all pretty much five star reviews and the owners are very responsive if you have questions very impressed with that part